Hey y'all, this is your girl Jamie here. I hope everybody is having a blessed evening and if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit the like button. We are going to speak about Kim Kardashian once again, y'all. This chick is too old and too messy to be a mom of four leaving her daughter on the side of the road outside of the Met Gala last night, y'all. Yes, you see that headline right there, disturbing. Okay, she's not just a regular mom, she's a celebrity. There were so many fans and paparazzi and, you know, everything out there last night. This little girl... Look, scared to death. She could have gotten, like, something could have happened to her. And she letting her daughter outside, like, she done kicked her to the side of the curb. Now, we all know that Kim did let her, I think, walk in to the Met Gala. But then it looks like she kicked her straight to the curb, y'all. Her own nine-year-old. I don't understand why this chick, like didn't ha like doesn't her kids go to school like why are these kids not in school it was a monday night most kids i know go to school on tuesday mornings now one of the fans you know they were snapping these photos and videos and stuff of north looking scared to death i'm assuming what it looks like she was waiting on a car but let's get right into the the story here it says a fan shared a video of nine-year-old North looking scared as she stood alone on the street in New York City on Monday evening, y'all. Mm, she should have been home in bed getting ready for school. This poor child. Mm. North was filmed standing on the sidewalk fiddling with her hair and clenching her bag, y'all. A photographer was seen standing next to the preteen and crunching as he took photos of her. The fan, who was standing opposite North in a crowd, posted the clip on TikTok and wrote, North is literally scared of us. Kim's critics reposted the clip and branded her vile for appearing to leave her child alone. One wrote, why has she been left there on her own with some random adult taking photos of her. She's nine years old. Why is Kim treating her like a blanking adult? She should be at home. Exactly. The same thing I'm saying, y'all. This child should be at home. And her kids are always, like, they were, she just had all four of her kids in Japan. Like, why are these kids not in school? Then it says, another added, oh my God, where is her mother, her family? She's alone with a stranger, stranger sorry y'all, taking pictures of her. Doesn't she have school tomorrow? Exactly. This is disturbing. Yes. Kim is so vile for this. North joined her mother on the white carpet at the Met Gala earlier in the evening this is not the first time that Kim has received backlash for her parenting decisions. Wow, y'all. She is disturbing. <laughs> Poor North, man. I feel bad for that little girl, man. And she's so cute. They all, all four of her little kids are so adorable. How are you going to leave your nine-year-old? in harm's way like that when you know you're a high you know celebrity like that like somebody could have just snatched her up man like in a heart man where is Kanye take this chick to court and get custody man like wow but also a lot of people also have been noticing the fact as you see these photos of this hotel room Kim also stated that her nine-year-old set this all up for her. Like, she just called room service and was like, yeah, can you send me some white roses and some white, you know, 
stupid candles and some balloons and some massage tables up for my mom now. But she's getting a lot of backlash on that, too, because everybody's calling her a liar. There's no way a nine-year-old set that all up. Now, I mean, North does seem like she's pretty clever and she's, you know, pretty smart and all, but really? Kim got some problems, man. Like, she was more worried about getting her photo taken because, you know, she was so embarrassed that everybody thought they wasn't invited. She was more worried about Pete Davidson and Usher getting up on, you know, <laughs> onto them. Putting it nicely, y'all, but she, she was, mm, she is definitely a doorknob and a garden, <laughs> a garden, uh, you know what, <laughs> oh, this child needs help, she needs Jesus, man, y'all, like this chick, she bugging, yo, for real, like, how's this chick gonna, let her, wow, like, why not just let her, her youngest one standing there on the corner like, hey. I mean, I'm I'm, I'm sure that North might have just been waiting on the car to come back around and pick her up. But Kim should have been standing out there with her until the car got there to pick her back up. She should have never, ever let that chat alone like that. Nah, this ain't Home Alone, Kim. This ain't, you know, Kevin. <laughs> you can't leave your child. <sighs> Come on, man. Like, she's a celebrity, man. Like, anybody could have did anything. Like, anything. There's crazy people, like, all over the place. What is wrong with this chick? I, I just don't understand her, man. Like, and then, like, this whole family... And if y'all seen the episode that came on after the Met Gala on E! Entertainment last night about the billionaire, they, they are not billionaires. They they lying. Kanye coming out talking about how they broke. They are, and they a damn joke broke. <laughs> they, they some joke broke. Like they so broke, broke, broke. Like I'm telling y'all. That's why they got to brag about everything they got. Most rich people don't got to brag. You don't see Adam Sandler bragging about anything he got. He dresses like a straight up bum all the time. Because he got money like that. He ain't bragging. He ain't selling toothpaste. You know, doing info commercials and country crock butter commercials and stuff. And pimping out their kids. Like, Kim straight up pimping out her little kids, man. Especially the girls. You never, ever, ever rarely see them boys, man. Never. I'm surprised to see this picture of her with her four kids. You never see the boys. Never. It's always the girls in the commercials. The country crock commercial with Chris and Chloe and True and Dream. You didn't see no boys in that commercial. I'm just saying, y'all, like, Kim is, like, yeah, the, Kanye need to get full custody of these kids. Him and his new wife, they need to do it pronto, like, for real, like, that, mm -mm, that's more than just disturbing. I mean, we got stalkers breaking into celebrities' houses and, you know, deleting herself and stuff. What is she thinking? This child is nine. I don't understand why these kids were not home. I mean, if they got all this money and stuff, where was the nanny at? Why was the nanny not there holding North's hand waiting on the car to come get her? Which I'm assuming that's probably what was, you know, she was waiting on probably. But if she got all this money and she a billionaire, where's the nanny's at? Why was the nanny not standing there with her? I don't get it. Scott Diss was even there with Penelope. You seen him getting out of the car when they all made it to Manhattan. Where was he? I mean, where was this child's, like, I, wow. This child should have been home. These kids should be home going to school every day. I don't care how much money they got. At the end of the day, 
stupid is as stupid does. I mean, she wants these kids to be smart or does she want them to make her money? Like her mama did all of them. Like, we all know what Chris is. Chris is a pimp. Straight up. She is. Mama, your pimp. So, if y'all haven't already hit that like button, make sure you definitely subscribe. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think in the comments about Kim, man. Would y'all leave your kid on the corner like that at a big function like that? I mean, the Met Gala is like the Super Bowl of the fashion world. Would you let your daughter, your nine-year-old, would you even have your nine-year-old daughter out? I already know what everybody's going to say, but, <laughs> but definitely have a blessed evening, y'all. And thanks for watching. And I will talk to y'all later. Bye.